Hey guys, I'm back with another video and I just want to motivate you guys to really focus on the things that you find important. You, you might not find cars important. You might not find watches important. Whatever motivates you guys to get up in the morning and get going, that's what you should do. As long as it's not harmful, as long as, as long as it's not hateful, as long as you got a passion for it and it can pay your bills, guys, do whatever you feel like doing. Don't worry about other people if they got a, if they got a nice car, if they have a nice watch, if they have a nice lady, if they have a big house. Don't worry about that stuff if, if, if that's not what you want. But guys, the universe is huge. It's massive. It's, not, it's in, endless. It's limitless. So go after whatever you want to go after. It's all here for you. I mean, who I mean, think about it, guys. What who else is going to use this stuff on this earth? Everything that's on this earth, earth is for you. Just because you live in Mobile, Alabama, uh Tumasuma, Mississippi, or or Gannett County, or you live in um and in, in Tulsa, Oklahoma, it don't matter where you live. Everything in the universe, on the planet, is here for you. So if you want a gold Lamborghini, get it. Go for it, guys. What, who else is going to use it? Think about it, guys. Don't let these people gaslight you into limiting the things that you value. If you don't value it, don't go after it. You don't see the guy with the Lamborghini talking down to the guy with the Hyundai. It's always the guy with the Hyundai saying, oh, I got a 1983 Hyundai. I don't need a Lamborghini. Well, why are you here watching a video about Lamborghinis then? Go watch the videos about Hyundais. But see, that's what people do. See, they say what they don't want or what they don't need. Because in the, cause deep down inside, they want that. That's why they're watching the video. So they can make a hateful comment to project their insecurities onto you and your mind so they can hijack your mind. Guys, go for what you think is important to you. As long as you, as long as it's not harmful or hateful. That's all I'm saying. As long as it's not harmful or hateful, get it and enjoy it. There's something for everybody out here. A ten thousand dollar car, somebody may enjoy it. 20,000, 30,000, 40,000, 50,000, 60,000, 70,000, 80,000, 90,000, 100, 120, 130, 140, 150. One, it, guys, it's, it, it's limitless, guys. There's something for everybody. No need to run around spreading fear and hatred about another, another person's financial category. Whether it's a G-Shock or a Rolex, it doesn't matter, guys. It does not matter at all. Whether you have a canoe or a yacht, it doesn't matter, guys. It does not matter at all. Whether you have a one-bedroom condo or a 50-bedroom mansion, guys, it doesn't matter. It's all going to go to dirt at the end of the day. It does not matter. It does not matter what somebody else have. It only matters what makes them feel worthy to get up and live their best life. If for some, it takes more for some people than other people. Some people take a cup of coffee to get up and live their best life. Other people, it takes um a, a, a jog around the block, a five-mile run. The person that's drinking a cup of coffee, not going to criticize the guy that's running five miles. Everybody's minding their own damn business. So guys, do whatever you want to do as long as it's not harmful or hateful. Hold on one second, guys. So if you want three girlfriends and live in a skyscraper, do it. Do it as long as it's not harmful or hateful. I mean, what what is the problem with people running around here worrying about what other people have that's going to satisfy them? You got people that's billion building million dollar companies, giving you a job. Your boss may have a Porsche. Your boss may have a Mercedes. 
your boss may have a, a Aston Martin or a Maserati. Okay. He's still no he's still no better than you. Are you happy with your family? If you happy with your family, with your children, with your lifestyle, be happy. Don't worry about your boss and his yacht and his mansion. He worked for that. If you feel that he's mistreating you, if you feel that he's stealing from you, go get you another job. Go find you another job. But if he's paying you, if he is paying you what you agreed to get paid, you can't complain. If you say, if he offered you 50000 you say, yeah, I work for 50000 then you, you, you can't worry about his lifestyle. Whether he's in debt, how much credit card debt he got, it's none of your business. It does not matter. It's not going to help you out one bit for you to try to uplift your financial status by looking down on somebody's financial status without looking at their bank account and finding out where they come from and where they're going and what they have. It, don't, it doesn't matter, guys. Hold on one second, guys. AI News Shorts, Red Pill Therapy, change your life in 60 seconds. Become the leader of your life. Don't wait for the president to make a decision. Well, guess what? Today you're the president. Now who can you blame? You're the boss. So elect yourself the president of your united self and start implementing policies that benefit and change your future. Appoint General Greatness as your vice president. Together, you will build your team of red pill assassins. Issue five executive orders to transform your life. Executive Order 303, seek truth and have purpose. Executive Order 606, dive deep. The power is within you. Executive Order 909, pursue discipline, it's the only way. Executive Order 013, know thyself, update your program, download your truth. Executive Orders 500, never go back. This is the beginning. Comment, like, and subscribe to your destiny.